The Labor Room Reality Show is a show with 37 participants representing the state of the Federation. Each of the participants with best projects aimed at either strengthening the unity of the country, boost the economy, development of the youth, among all the positive intentions, have been in this house for a number of 61 days. After a chat with the Information Minister on the 61st day, which happens to be the last day, they argued that their ability to live comfortably with each other for 61 days, despite their religious, ethnic diversity, has proven that the country can be united if the chance is given. Okay, in Nigeria, we have a culture of criticizing, analyzing, scrutinizing, and paralyzing issues. So we have reached a point that we want to stop talking. We want to start preferring solutions. You can't change a nation just by building roads. You can't change a nation just by building skyscrapers. If human structure is not well taken care of, infrastructure will be destroyed. So the people you saw there for 30 days, for 60 days, from different religion, different ethnicity, they've bonded, as the Honorable Minister said. And it's from that soft way of bonding that we can transform Nigeria. Nigeria does not change when you build good roads. It's change. Change is when you build good minds. It's been wonderful staying in the same mansion with 37, okay, 36 governors from different states who've been sharing ideas on how to move Nigeria forward, though we've had misunderstanding, but still the unity was still there. So we've been doing great. We loved each other and that's the most important thing. That's the message we're trying to send to the world that with our ethnic differences, we can still live as one and solve the problems of Nigeria. The uh, Muslims, we watch, the Christians worship with the Muslims, and the Muslims worship with the Christians. We see the differences in our, in our religion and all that. In his address, the information minister who lauded the initiative added that there is need for the citizens to give peace a chance in the country as these youths have proven. I think it's been a mind-blowing experience for me to realize that there are 37 young Nigerians who have been in this uh, labor room, so to say, the last 60 days. And uh, all they've been doing the last 60 days is bonding, preaching unity, dreaming of a new Nigeria, having a vision of a Nigeria where people would not be judged on whether they are from the north, from the west, or from the east, but rather in Nigeria where people will be judged on the basis and strength of their commitment and patriotism. While United Nigeria is part of the objectives of this show, and the success of the show is a pointer that the United Nigeria devoid of ethnic or religious disunity is achievable.